We just had a very scary experience in the motorhome. <laughs> Doc Weiler. Getting the sewer hooked up by Shannon Rose. Woo, that's it, baby. You got it. Now take the red piece, okay. stick it in, and twist it on. Gotta turn it, twist it. Look at the look at the connection to make sure you're turning the right way. Yeah, that doesn't gonna leak. Can uh we hurry up a little bit. We don't be out here all night. All right, I got it. <laughs> and then this they just part. come over here and slip that piece right in there. And that's it. It's supposed to come. Yeah, that's more? good. Just put it there. Looks like it's. Uh... For all the people that said that I didn't look like. Wait, is this oh. supposed to plug into this? No, honey, no. Okay, that's there you it? go. I think we're gonna need to screw that's it out a little bit. No. That'll work. That's okay. it. So, uh, Thank you very much. That looks like Relieve the tension. Yeah, let's do let's do that. You need to learn to drive this. Yeah, right. You that do, that'd honey. be scary. People better get off the road if I'm behind the wheel. <laughs> yeah, you need to learn to run. We have this here with snow oh. on our first camping oh. trip. Oh, the sun know. might be in your eyes. Oh yeah, maybe. It's okay. Don't cry, sweet pea. I know what you want. Do you want this? Your book? What's your cow book? Ooh, dogs. And cows. Rough around the edges, but I bought it on Facebook. And, and I'm not a sausage, people showed up. But I like that. And we're all hanging out. It's hard sausage. Mm -hmm. Doesn't taste day, like a god. My yeah, stepmom, yeah. my dad, yeah. my sister, yeah. Snow, Sometimes my mom, Trav, and we have some more people coming, this and this is just really cool. No it's still like um so not renovated yet, but we're really enjoying it, and it's really nice to have. Mm -hmm. Kind of the same family and like hanging out. Yeah, Hi, Annie. Wow, look at her. Say hi, Mom. See, I love when she does those eyes, like big eyes. <laughs> look at her looking around. She's so curious. Are you oh, in they're the big eyes. <laughs> <laughs> so much to see right now. Don Rickles. Where's it? <laughs> <laughs> Are you on more pills than Carter? <laughs> Is that how you say it? Oh, no, God. you got more Just cheeks than Carter does pills. Oh, <laughs> don't. Who like your no grandpa? No teasing huh? her. Who like your grandpa? Snowy. She's going, I've never had this much attention. <laughs> oh, we gotta get the pull permit for this, pull for that. Oh, you have, to, you have to change out the toilet because that's not come like, okay, obviously, like, obviously I'm not going with you, period. But I'd like to get a quote. I mean, I didn't say that to him. Yeah. But I'm... It has a you know, GFCR, oh, sweet. which is connected with the top. He's like, oh, well, it doesn't have a special like one like this. And, oh, this is a 1.7 gallon flow. Like you have to have a little less than so I wanted to go ahead and give you guys a little sneak peek of some of the renovations that we have done only in the back of the motorhome and we got new carpets and floors and then we painted the back like the bedroom area. So this is what it looks like. It's nowhere near being done. We still have to put blinds and all that but we actually stayed in the RV with no blinds and it rained the whole next day but it was still really fun. Travis just eating some food before we get back on the road. Mm -hmm. How's your burger? They did a pretty good job. Looks pretty good. Nice. Got their backup camera. I'm eating some uh, tofu, rice, and black beans with olive oil and salt. Really good. And we also have some vegan chocolate chip cookies that are really also yummy. That LA traffic though. That's We're gonna get that jolly jumper. We're gonna install that thing right on top of this RV right here. <laughs> then Travis gotta make sure he gets his six pack, twelve pack of beer. I'm sorry, I meant to say twelve. Yeah, it's only gonna last you about twenty minutes. <laughs> How long are you planning on spending up there? What is it called when the people from jail get the sex, the sex pass? What is sex pass? What, yeah, what is that called? It's a, con a conjugal visit. Oh my god! Well, however long it takes for my conjugal visit, that's how long we'll be right up there. <laughs> <laughs> 
right up where? <laughs> oh no! That prison rat right down there. Oh my god. <laughs> we just had a very scary experience in the motorhome that made me literally look at Trav and say we're selling this thing. Oh Lord, tell him what happened. We were going very slow because it was raining. The motorhome hydroplaned on the freeway. We're going like sideways on the freeway basically. Nope, not happening again. So we pulled over so I can feed snow. I just got really scared and we were going really slow and that still happened so it just made me want to sell the motor home and be like oh, done with it. I don't know. We're supposed to be going to this family reunion that's all the way in Florida. And we are going to drive all the way across the country. But I'm having second thoughts now. Because I don't feel safe and I'm like so paranoid and like freaked out the whole drive, you know. Because it was raining. Now the weather has cleared up. And so I feel a lot safer. Um driving in it but I definitely do not feel safe driving in the rain and I literally made Travis go like 35 40 miles an hour in the slow lane there's like everyone's going around us I'm like I don't care just go slow I'm calling my dad I'm, not, I'm gonna ask him if he wants to buy the motorhome <laughs> hey campers how are we doing good afternoon camper <laughs> hey you want to buy a motorhome <laughs> <laughs> oh, the trials and tribulations of owning a motorhome. Oh my god, I literally told Travis, hey, why don't we just flip this thing? I think, I think I'd rather fly. <laughs> that was scary. Yeah. Well, wait till you go to Florida. How many rainstorms you'll go through. <laughs> yeah, I know. I told Travis, like, mm, I think, do you think you want to fly instead? We are cracking up. Yeah, it's, it's a, so yeah. But it really did uh, hydroplane, huh? Yes. It's clearing up here. Oh, thank God. Yeah. Yeah, that was scary. It's unbelievable how much it ran pretty good to, too. Yeah, and these people are flying in these motorhomes and the truckers are go we're going so fast. Well, honey, they all do. That's what I told you. You'll see that they just, a lot of those guys drive 65, 70 miles an hour. Yeah, it's just seems really dangerous. I'm like, I was really, I'm considering selling the motorhome. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so scared. It's so awesome and fun, like once it's parked, you know? But driving it, yeah, it makes well, me nervous. To, you just have to, you know, just tell Travis he can drive it and he'll fly and he'll meet you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I like that idea. Yeah. What do you think is safer? Probably safer. I, I don't know. I don't know. I would say the nine out of the five is safer because it's more of an open straight you're not turned, you're not going up and down, and that's pretty much all straight. Yeah, that's what Travis said too, so that's what we'll probably do. Okay, stop 320 on our drive home to feed this little angel. Hi, sweet girl! I love playing with her, you guys. She's so... <laughs> you're so cute! She's so vocal right now. Also, I'm looking at mom wardrobe because I suck at like style. I literally wear pajamas everywhere. And so my friend Chantel is sending me pictures of what to wear. And same with my friend Lainey. They're like sending me pictures of mom wardrobe. <gasps> Am I smothering you with all my kisses? I'm gonna give you all of them. It was really cute, you guys. Someone called Snow's Hamangioma a unicorn horn and I thought that that was so sweet so now I'm gonna call it your unicorn horn it's so beautiful you special angel you're my little unicorn my little rainbow unicorn oh, I love you so much she you guys uh, has definitely been a handful on the way home on the way here she was really good um, and on the way home, she is not taking as many naps. She does really good in our car seat. Like, I put a bunch of toys for her to look at and stuff for her to play with, huh? Um, but I think that she's, like, maybe starting to teeth. I know. Are you maybe starting to teeth a little bit? Not, like, bad teething where, like, I need to give her Tylenol or anything because I don't think the teeth are, like, breaking through anytime soon. But, uh, man, I'm looking rough around the edges. <laughs> I haven't been getting very much sleep with her either lately, but uh, yeah, it's been um, it's been a journey, you guys, like a little adventure, huh? It's been an adventure. 
You are just so stinking cute. Oh my god, don't look at my gross feet. I haven't had a manicure or a pedicure in so long. It was so embarrassing. I was on set and I like they were like, oh, do some stuff like with your hands. And I was like, oh my god, I have not had a manicure. You do not want to see my hands. Huh. You don't want to see my hands. Are you the cutest to the Buddhist? Yeah, you are. Say, I'm Snow and I love everyone. Somehow we managed to run out of diapers. I don't know how this happened, but like we brought a bunch and they're now gone. And so we literally have like no diapers left. And so we're also trying to find diapers. But the place that we stopped off, like obviously not a Target, a Walmart for like miles and miles and miles. So I was like, let's check a gas station. We need to get gas anyways. And we can uh, see if they have diapers at one of these gas stations. No diapers yet. So wish us luck. That's not me farting, it's snow making noises, farting noises with their mouth. Uh, so we are on store number three, like gas station number three to try to find diapers. I am crossing my fingers that this one has it. We're at like 76 Food Mart. I just let it too. I don't know if you can hear it or not. We're getting close now, nowadays. Now that we're RVing. Hey, excuse me, I hear you. Are you mad that I tooted? Is it stinky toots? No, it doesn't smell, Mama. I know, honey. We gotta change your diaper. Thankfully, she didn't. I was gonna say, oh my god, I should just poop just now. Honey, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh! Come on, Trav. Please have diapers. <laughs> What's the matter, sweet snow? Snow Rose, are you? <laughs> what are you doing with your little feet? She's like kicking me with her left foot. She loves just kicking her left foot out the most. Honey, why are you being so fussy? Ooh, you sticking this wing at me? I just fed you. Is it because your diaper is dirty? Yes, I do, I love you. Oh God, please tell me you got diapers. <laughs> they had diapers? Chicolas de classy. <laughs> Let me see. Awesome. What does it say? Can you read it? Chicolastic classic. Mediano. Yes, come through Mexican diapers. Snow bear, look at this. Hold on. It should be loud. All right, you guys, about to do some diaper changes right now. Should we just stop at the gas station to get some diapers and a cold brewski for the ride home? <laughs> I'll say that people will be all freaked out. Like, That's not a joke, man. You guys were obviously joking. I had some coconut water. That's my treat. You got a coconut water. So now we are currently on our way home. We've had so many stops, but hopefully Snow is gonna fall asleep in our car seat and we will have a nice little maybe 30 minutes of quiet adult time. <laughs> oh, was that, that funny? Was joke for the day. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Uh, I've gotten up like 60 times to go check on her. Every time I sit down and like get comfortable, then she starts crying. I have to go back there again and try to entertain her until she's okay, but. Oh no. It's taken us over 10 hours already. So it's not almost 9.30 at night. We've been driving for almost 10 hours. We left at, we left LA at noon, so long, long trip. So we finally made it home safe and sound. It took us over 11 hours to get home from LA all the way back to Sacramento and uh, the reason why is just because it was raining so we were going super slow and we had to stop a bunch to feed and change snow but uh, it was definitely an adventure and we are actually going to be leaving for a whole month in the RV traveling across country so definitely stay tuned for that. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to um, subscribe. I'm sending you all my love and positive energy and I hope to see you in my next video. Mwah!